hate guards. You've returned, I see. This place is fucking weird. And you're not sprouting mold from your eyes. I take it that means my pill worked. Now tell me everything. Did you find the source? You did, didn't you? I found a big, angry plant. Like, gigantic. I killed it. You killed it! You found the source and you killed it! I could have learned so much from a live specimen! Her concern is touching. Really, it's too much. Here, I brought you a sample. A piece of the innermost mold! You're not such a lost cause after all. Strange. So different, even superficially. Another stage of growth, perhaps. Please, no more stages. You'll be pleased to know that cutting down the creature at the source has already resulted in a notable cessation of the mold's rapid growth. You've bought me time for further study. So what now? I'm glad you asked. While you were busy in the pit, a number of mold hosts were sighted beyond the threshold. They managed to sneak out without the rangers noticing. There's a reason I didn't send Steve and Andy to find the mold source with the others. These vagrant hosts must be eradicated as soon as possible. The mold can still be spread by their overgrown bodies. Any idea where they went? The hosts I've observed are not a sprightly bunch. Here are the reports I've received. They'll help you find them. I'll go take care of them. Good. And do be quick about it. There's a nice way to say that. I assume you'll be staying with us until the mold is eradicated. Indeed. Until I find a permanent resolution to this pesky fungus business, I'll be here. Perhaps even beyond that, seeing as you are quite... understaffed at the moment. Though, I hardly have a say in my own comings or goings. Your oldest house won't open the exits until those hiss monstrosities are cleared out. Glad to have you along for the ride. Will the mold be under control anytime soon? We were barely containing it with weakly controlled burns. Just look at how it has spread after a few days of non-interference. It's beyond the threshold now. The floodgates are open. So that's a no. Americans. With Darling gone, I'm putting Emily Pope in charge of the research sector. Are you okay with that? Perfectly. You have pulled Excalibur from the stone and now decree as you see fit, O oh Queen. What a true meritocracy we live in. Glad to hear it. I had a dream. Or something like one. Darling was there. He told me something, but I... Can't remember what. I think he's gone. Right. Well, he's never where one expects him to be, is he? Well, thank God. I can finally stop writing these tedious reports that I'm sure he never even took the time to glance at. If you speak to him again, can you tell him I... I hope he found what he was looking for. I'll try. I should be getting back to work. I'll see you later, Rhea. Dr. Underhill, if you please. Guard duty. 
been here. Talk to the plants. Small talk was never really my strong suit. At least small talk was never really my strong suit. At least they can't talk back. Your day has been productive, little plant. <laughs> that really works, huh? I hope those nasty hiss haven't been bothering you too much.
Why'd they keep an altered item here? Debrief for Mirror Excursion 7C. Subject is Agent Hardy. Hardy spent approximately three hours in the mirror. It's the longest time on record. Can you describe your experience inside, Agent Hardy? Agent Hardy is physically healthy. All tests have come back clean. Yet the speech issue has persisted for hours. Calm down, Agent. It could be psychosomatic, but the fact that this only occurred after returning from the mirror makes a paranatural explanation more likely. I recommend a battery of tests and a class orange quarantine. Way to lock something up. Yeah, <laughs> Wait, that didn't sound right. <laughs> Yeah, that's not good. What? I can't understand you. You need to listen. I saw something in there. There is something inside. You need to lock down the mirror. <laughs> Why are you talking like that? What's wrong with you? All of you? There's something in that fucking mirror!
bet someone's in there. Hurry, Nano Masoon. Whoa. Not if you search for her, have you? Um, that's not good.
You and Hedron were never one and the same. She... So long as the hiss are out there, we'll be making It helped Darling with the HRAs to slow the hiss down. And it helped me learn to tap into this power I had inside. You... MIT. How about you? Also MIT. were as pretty as yours. <sighs> Do you have a family? I have a brother. I miss him a lot. in leadership roles. I have no on-the-job training. Your chlorophyll really brings out the green in your leaves. That's all of them. But I kind of wish there were more. They're good listeners.
Thank you. 